Hey guys, this is a battle against some guy of some all you horror of Cerebi. And he starts I start with Ristio, he starts off with Mammoth Swine. And I know it's a lead Mammoth Swine, so I just wanna set up Stealth Rock. And he earthquakes me, which does quite a bit of damage. And I set up my own stealth rock, but I didn't expect him to let me live. But he sets up his own stealth rock and I ice punch just to get the focus dash off, but I didn't expect to live. What I should have done was toxic, but uh oh well. So he kills Rage Steel and Earth he earthquakes Rage Steel and kills it. And then I go into Yoshi, who's always usually reliable. But he earthquakes me again. And that does quite a huge chunk, it leaves it about a little more than half, and I use counter. But I don't know if it was a low damage multiply low damage calculation thing or if it was just really max HP or something, but it didn't kill it. And that really sucks because it took out two of my Pokemon. So he uses Endeavor, I finish it off with Ice Punch. Fire Punch, sorry. And Mammoth Swine goes down. Uh, next he goes into Empoleon. And I guess this is his kind of mistake here because he agilities and he probably should have killed me because I use Explosion. And surprisingly that does quite a bit considering how bulky um, Empoleon is. And next I send in Ludicolo. And I know hit any attack it throws me won't be able to one hit KO because Ludicolo has a pretty good special attack. And he survives with less than half HP. And I use Grass Nut to kill it. And then he goes to the Zapdos, which I really did not want to see. And he Thunderbolts my Ludicolo, and I go down. Yeah, and then I go into Venusaur. Um, knowing I can survive at least one attack. And turns out I'm faster because this is a bulky, um, bulky Zapdos. But I didn't really know what, which um, side he um, throws his defenses towards. So I just Swords Dance. And then he goes into a Specs Jolteon. And he hit and powers me, I stand because I know that Venusaur can stay, um, survive the hit and power ice or fire, whatever it is. Because I did the calculations and I earthquake back for the kill. Yay. Um. Next he goes back into Zapdos. And. I get, try to go for another Swords Dance, but my bad luck just... I just get bad luck and he wakes up the next this exact turn. So I put it to sleep again, and that's just free really leftovers recovery for me. So I think I'm strong enough to um, get at least some huge damage on it, but also this is a physically bulky Zapdos, so it doesn't really do much at all. And of course he wakes up the second turn and I set him to sleep. I mean the turn after I set him to sleep. So that's really sucks. Next I go into a Toria because I just want to kill this stupid Zapdos. And he's faster so he thunderbolts me but Altaria is pretty bulky on both sides of the defense spectrum so it can survive. And I get a Dragon Dance off. Then I go for the Roos just to heal up before I start sweeping but then he goes for the Thunderbolt and this is what just screwed me over he gets to paralyze with the Thunderbolt um, at the end of the video you see the rest of his team I might have been, possibly been able to s sweep, it, sweep with Altaria but we'll never know because I got the paralyze um, then he goes for the sub his right he switches into Rhyperior, Perior, and he goes for a sub, but I Earthquake, uh, just to kill a sub, or get some damage off, because I was expecting him to use Stone Edge. Then he goes for the Stone Edge here, but he misses, thank god. And I go for the Dragon Dance, hoping that I'm, that'll boost my speed up faster than Rhyperior, but Rhyperior 
but it doesn't and he stone edges me and down goes Altaria. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, okay, next I go into Melodic. And for some strange reason he didn't want to switch out here, so it takes the four times hydro pump to the face and it goes down. Haha. -ha. And right now Melodic is just my last leg, right? And it still did, did some pretty decent damage to the rest of his team all by itself. So I go for he goes into my champ now and I know it's either gonna be a dynamic punch one, punching one or um, a bulk up one. Turns out it's the dynamic punching one. And the like is bulky enough to survive at least one hit, but I get and I get confused. Do the dynamic punches automatic confuse. And I was hoping I could at least kill this Machamp, but uh, of course not. And I hit myself and it dynamic punches and I lose. So good game, comment, rate, subscribe guys, see you later.